In this video, let's take a look at how you can change the time on your iPad. And there are multiple things you can mean by that, so let's just begin with it. First of all, most iPads run on automatic time. So you can check it out if you go to the settings, then to the general section, and here is a date and a time. So if you tap on it, you can see a couple of different things. So for me, it's set automatically. So I cannot even go to the time zone settings because it's just not allowed me too. Set automatically works well because it uses your internet connection, your location and all the data that it needs and you don't really have to worry about anything. You know when there is daylight saving and the time changes, you don't need to worry about any of that. So it's just gonna be set automatically and I think that it's a good thing. However, you can disable it and go to the uh, time zone section. So you can search for, for example, I don't know, like London. So London, England, now it's going to change to a different time. So it tells me that right now I'm in the London time zone and it's a completely different thing. However, I don't also need to rely just on the time zone and the locations because I can just click on the date and the time and I can just set it manually for some reason. I can just make it go like, it's uh, 11 35 a.m. for some reason if I want to do it now it's uh, if I zoom it in you can see it's 11 35 a.m. it's not in reality so it's definitely not a useful thing to do it's not a useful setting which you can customize but you can do it if you really wanted to the only thing I can imagine is for some kind of app to get around some time limitations and stuff but it's not gonna work for uh, for a lot of things and it's pretty limited of course so I don't think that uh, almost anyone should be uh, setting the time like this I would advise you to come back to set a time automatically you could see that for example if I turn this off and on it also changes uh, the focus mode because I have it scheduled automatically it's also another thing so for example I'm gonna choose one London England and now it tells me that the work is on because I have it till 12 uh, p.m. In this case, it's just 11 at 20, uh, 11 28 a.m. So right now I'm still in a work mode. However, if I turn on the automatic time, and it's just going to realize that I'm not in a work mode anymore. So it's going to turn off the work and you can see that uh, everything is okay now. And I'm not in a work mode anymore is because I have it set uh, to end at 12 PM. So it's past that and it turns it off. Other time settings included the 24 hour time, which allows you to choose it at that. So it's not like 12 PM, but it's 12. It's going to be 13, 14. It's uh, the military time as some people say. So yeah, this is the 24 hour time and you can also show a.m. p.m. in the status bar for some reason if doesn't if this doesn't confuse you enough you can also just turn it off completely and you don't know if it's a morning or evening so yeah a couple of different options in here if you really want to get advanced with this you can go to the clock app and go to the world clock section where you can see like a, a sunshine layer or wave and you can see what the time is around the world you can add locations and stuff so it's a nice way to track the time around the world i mean it's much better than simply me switching to a london time zone so yeah i'm not sure what you actually want to achieve with this but yeah these are the options which are built in from apple you can use it right away and there there's no problem with that of course third party apps on the app store do similar thing but like i said if you want to have it like make sure that this work across the entire system you need to set it up in the settings in the stock settings of ipad os anyways hope this video helped you out hope to, hope you found some answer that you were looking for and if you did i'd really really appreciate a thumbs up and for more time information about the ipad watch this video right here and you're gonna find out more about it